Hi, my name is Jackie, and I'm a farmer in South Central Kansas. But I didn't grow up here. I'm originally from Wisconsin, and in Wisconsin, we grow lots of cranberries. So today's question that I'm gonna be answering is, do cranberries really grow underwater? You've probably seen the commercials where the ocean spray folks are standing in water at least up to their knees and hip waders and cranberries are floating around them, which makes a lot of people think that they grow in water. But actually, water is only flooded into the cranberry beds during harvest time. Cranberries grow on vines, and a vine is a little bit like a tree, but instead of growing up like a tree does, a vine grows along the ground. And those woody vines end up having the berries on it, just like you would find other fruits and berries in bushes or on trees. And so cranberries, when it's time to harvest, um, actually are flooded for a really interesting reason. So if you look inside a cranberry, there are actually four hollow chambers. And those four hollow chambers typically contain air, which makes cranberries buoyant, which means that they float when you put them in water. So cranberry farmers use that to their advantage. They use machines to help pull the berries off of the vines, and then the berries float to the top of the water, which makes them easier to move around with buoys, just like in a swimming pool, that kind of corral them to one end of the bed and allow them to either use vacuums or augers to pull them out of the water for harvest. So the next time you and your family are enjoying a glass of cranberry juice or some craisins, and somebody asks, do they really grow in water? You'll know the answer, no. They grow on a vine and they're only flooded during harvest because you know their secret.